Yo, what's the deal, y'all? Welcome back to another episode of O's Closet. If you haven't already, be sure to subscribe to my channel. I made it really easy, really simple. All you gotta do is click the custom OB logo at the bottom right hand corner of the screen to join the team. I've been watching the subscribers jump up and yo, I just wanna say thank you guys for continuing to subscribe and continue to inspire me and to make great content. With that said, let's get into today's topic. Five different ways to wear the same hat. Let's get into it. y'all know the drill every every episode we got to pour up another drink you know the last episode i asked you guys to leave it in the comments what we should fill this thing up with no one ever gave me an answer on what this thing is yet so i'm just gonna call it a thing until one of you guys respond dc walk one he told me to grab some rum view bell or dodge however you pronounce it dc walk one bro i went to the liquor store it just didn't have it man so i attempted to grab it unfortunately i couldn't find it for today's episode but i'm gonna keep searching for it bro and hopefully i could sip it one time with y'all on an episode coming in the near future what i got right now is some japanese whiskey wanted to change it up a little bit so yeah that's what we're gonna be sipping for the next few episodes man a little japanese whiskey all right let me tip that cup one time Cheers. Nice, that's smooth. Ah. Five different ways to wear a Law 17 trucker hat. So Law 17 has become one of my favorite brands over the past two years. It's one of my favorite hats in my collection. I wear it quite often. So I figured I'd give you guys various different ways to rock this different hat. So I got a couple different outfits lined up. Um, different flavors for different occasions. I think you guys will appreciate the variety I'm about to bring to you guys. So with that said, let's just hop straight into it. I'm gonna throw on the first fit, break it down and explain it to you guys what it's for, where you should wear it at, and how you can wear it seamlessly with the same hat. All right, let's do it. <clears throat> summer, summer time. Pam, um, I didn't even get to talk about this Kobe versus Jordan shirt. My homie, my brother, Twee, we went to college together and he's now coaching Canadian League, basketball league up in, in Canada. He sent me this shirt. The brand is Noir A Noir. I think I said that right. But y'all check them out on Instagram. Just wanted to show a quick little love to the homie and support the brand. I think it's a dope shirt. I think y'all love it too. I'm almost certain it means black is black or black on black. You guys leave in the comments below what you think it is. Woo! All right, first fit up. First fit up. This is what, yo, so guys, I broke, check, check me out, head to toe. I threw on a little K-Dot uh, Tour Merch T. Maybe it was the TDE Tour. I think that's what it was. Yeah, TDE Tour. And I got on some custom-made shorts from a good friend of mine, an Australia designer named Cara Craig. And they got uh, like a, an underlining, almost like, like trunks. So I broke every fit up into a category. So this first fit is under the social category, okay? So to me, I wanted to stay true to the season, which it is the summer. And just think about how I would approach a social gathering right now in the summertime. Thinking about like a day party or just something social outside, outdoors in the daytime. And for me, I think this is where it's at. It's, it's obviously summertime. So I wanna have my shorts on. I want my legs to breathe a little bit. And yeah, I just played off the colors. You know, I, I know there was a, a yellow and red theme here on the shirt and I thought that brought in the orange really well. And I've really been looking for an opportunity to bust these shattered backboards. If you guys didn't see that episode of Top 5 favorite sneakers go back and check that out i spoke about these and really looking for the opportunity for when i could wear these and this would definitely be one for sure this is definitely one of the easiest ways to bust this law 17 trucker hat chill and laid back fit social uh, i go to a party i'm good whether i want to get in the pool or not it's still good i got a good look going on here whether i could be in vegas at the day party fam it is closed right now, but y'all know, this is assuming that we live in our normal lives, fam. Yeah, this is look number one, the social fit. Shout out to K-Dot. See how I threw the Nike socks on with the Nikes? See that? Swoosh life, fam. I know I used to be a Nike athlete. I'm a free agent now though, so like, if anybody wanna holla at me, call me. All right, so we will get into fit number two. The category will be athleisure. So I'm gonna hop into that right now. You guys familiar with athleisure wear? If not, when I put it on, I'm pretty sure you're gonna understand exactly what it is. 
always keep these guys. Don't throw these things away, man. They keep the form to your shoes, especially when you're dealing with leather or patent leather. You have to deal with creases. Very good to keep those type of things for the longevity of the sneaker, fam. You feel me? Y'all feel me? How'd you head if you feel me? Okay, cool. You hear me knocking? Let me in. This show is PG-13. Don't worry about it. No magic mics going on here. Some thunder thighs, though. No magic mics. All right. All right, so I got a little dilemma here on this next fit. Maybe you guys can help me figure it out, fam. I got a gray tank and a gray shirt. They're both the same, same designer. I just didn't know which one I wanted to rock. So y'all can help me figure it out. We in this thing together, right? Y'all let me get away with this tan band on my watch with that last outfit, fam. Now that ain't it. All right, bet. Here we go. Fit number two. It's the athleisure, y'all. All right. Athleisure, for those that don't know, athleisure is like athletic apparel, workout gear that you more so wear casually. Not only would you wear it to the gym, but you would wear it outside of the gym as well. So what I have right here is this Daniel Patrick long line tank. All right, it's one of my favorite tanks in the building or in my collection. All right, nice little split here. Okay, and I got on some Law 17 track pants as well as my Law 17 truck hat. You all see that? First of all, y'all can't let me be out here like this, fam. So I had to switch my watch, right? Cause I always like my jewelry to match. And as you can see, a lot of the accents on the accessories are silver or stainless steel, crossbody bag, as well as a Louis Vuitton keychain. So I wanted to go ahead and throw on the AP with this rubber band, all right? So I thought that brought it together nice and neat. I had the thought of busting the actual t-shirt, but to me, I'm really content with this look right here. What y'all think? It's cool, y'all vibe with it? Hey, y'all see, I'm not a pool butt, fam. Get a close look at this. Because of the low cut shoe and the way these pants are, I gotta rock the no shows, fam. I got on my Vans, so it's only appropriate that I got on the Vans no shows, you feel me? Vans, holla at your boy. They, the, the people wanna see a top five Vans episode. Come on now, rock with your boy, Vans. That is the athleisure fit done up with the Law 17 trucker hat. The next fit is street style. I'm really a fan of streetwear, so I'm really excited about this next fit. So let's get into that. See these pants, fam? They're like that in between, like where I, I need a belt, but I don't need a belt. Those are the poo butt traits right there, fam. You got a poo butt trait. Man, how many of y'all went and got some tailored done? Anybody? Anybody take any advice I gave them? Has anyone got any numbers? That's the real question, fam. Has, it, has the advice I gave you guys in the last episode worked at any bit? Matter of fact, there was somebody who left a comment about my tips being some BS, but he said he didn't even watch the full video, fam. And then he went on to tell me that those tips only work if you're an 80s baby. And if you're born in the new generation, it doesn't work because these girls listen to Cardi B and Megan Thee Stallion. Let me see what your name was. Rogue God. Rogue God, fam. It don't matter what generation you were in. Every woman want to be respected. Every woman want a, a man's going to smile on her face, make her feel good, feel confident. These things are universal. It don't matter what generation you born in, bro. Either way, fam, there's just like a certain code that women live by and that men live by. And it doesn't matter, regardless of what these women are listening to, every woman is searching for direction and wants to be guided. That's just how it is. That's that's in their nature. They want direction from a man. Don't fall into the hype, man. If you find a girl that's attractive, that you really want, go after her, bro. And don't let what you think these women are listening to deter you from you know, your goal, which is that woman. So, bro, if you're looking for a better way to like understand yourself as well as women, I wanna suggest that you check out the book, The Way of the Superior Man. It's not only helped me have a better understanding of women, but also myself, and I think it could definitely help you. What I wanna do is just give you guys a video of my top five favorite books right now, and that's one of them. If you guys wanna hear about next four, drop it in the comments below, and I'll cook up that episode ASAP, all right? Cause I'm all about self-improvement and growth. Those five books that I have on my list right now could help everyone. You know what's crazy, guys, is right now, See, I didn't try on any of these fits, right? And right now, like, I'm not really digging this one. Let me get this fit right before we move on because I don't feel I don't feel like me, right? Like, it's all about you when you walk outside. If you're not feeling confident, switch it up. So let me go ahead and grab those pants and get right. Sheesh. All right. Damn, I just went so fast, I got ghost hairs on me. Sheesh. Hey, here's a pro tip. Lint roller is a must, fam. Before you get ready to go out, right? Get your clothes on. All nice and ready. Tear you off a new sheet. And go ahead and remove any lint. 
dog hair, anything that could be left on you, especially on black. All right, the last thing we want to do is walk out. Shit, you never know, you might end up with some photos or something. Okay, so this right here is the street look. So I threw on the Purpose Tour, I'm out here recycling fits, fam. Y'all remember the Purpose Tour? Are y'all Bieber fans? Are you a Belieber? A Bieber? Bieber. Beeps. Yeah, this is a collaboration between him and Fear of God. A little Purpose Tour merch. I always love concert merch. I don't know what it is. I feel like if you don't get it, it's gone. You may be able to catch it like on some resale shit, but it's usually, yeah, it's only there at the concert or at the event and they don't even sell it in stores. So I really appreciate and love tour merch, concert merch. I meshed it really well with some jeans that actually fit the way I want them to. Threw on some distressed black jeans, cuffed them at the bottom. These ones actually came cuffed. They come cuffed. I, I gotta get them an extra one um, just to show the white sock. And threw on some of my favorite Nike Sakai's. These are a collaboration with Sakai and Nike. Some of my favorites. I've actually wore these in the episode already before. And as you guys can see, I got the white socks showing, fam. I'm not a pool butt because this is the look for me today, all right? So I'm bringing out the white in the jersey, the white in the hat. This is the fit that you will wear during the daytime and carry on into the night, no problems. I love dressing in the street, fam. I throw on that Panerai submersible, you know? Yeah, and y'all don't even know about that, fam. Yo, when it comes to these time pieces, fam, I got all the classics, bro. Classics, timeless, no ice, fam. Nah, no ice, fam. Plain chains only. And I can't let another fit go by because I got called out on last episode. So let me just tap in with homie. What did he say? Steph Mac 400 say he ain't take a sip out that cup yet, fam. Hey, you luck. Hey, you are absolutely right. And I'm tired of taking damn shots at the end of the episode. So thank you for checking me, bro. Holding me accountable. I appreciate that. That's what, hey, that's what creating a family, a brotherhood is all about, fam. A network. You got people that hold you accountable, bro. And I appreciate you for holding me accountable. Accountability, Sip. Woo! Woo! Sheesh! Ah, put a little hair on that chest, fam. Japanese whiskey. I'm excited about the next two fits. So the next fit is what we will call casual. So let's go ahead and get into that right now. All right, guys. So as I said, this next fit will be casual. Some of you may be looking at this fit like, damn, that's a little... That's a little dressy to be casual. You could never be overdressed. I guess you could be overdressed in some situations, but the last thing you ever want to be is underdressed, right? So we just went overdressed for this casual look, okay? And now this is a risky look too, because I went patterns on patterns, right? And I'm going patterns are going in opposite directions, right? So obviously these patterns are going vertical. And some of these patterns are going horizontal. Obviously there's some vertical lines in there as well, but I'm taking a risk. And that may have been tip number five on top five fashion tips. If you want to go back and check out that video. Sometimes you got to take some risks, man. Put on those pattern pants, you know, those plaid pants that you got in the closet or that you only trying on in the mirror. Take that chance. You may hit, you may miss. Either or, you got to take a chance sometimes. But this is definitely a nice casual look for me. We're here with the same Law 17 trucker hat, right? So look how universal a black and white hat could be. And it could be any black and white hat. I suggest you guys head over to Law 17 and copy you this new trucker, but that's just my opinion. And this is a shoe that we haven't talked about, we haven't spoke about yet in, in O's closet, but I'm a huge fan of Docs. And I, I mean, I could even break down top five of my favorite Docs. If, if that's something you guys are interested in, because I have that many pairs. And we're about to get on to the last and final look. I had a hard time choosing, so I'm gonna have to let you guys choose. I actually have to try on both fits because I didn't know which one I wanted to wear. That category is chic, and I'm excited to get into it, so let's go ahead and do that. For our fifth and final look, we got the chic look. I'm going ahead and going the top down, suit top down, the sky blue, light blue, whatever we want to call it. To be honest, I'm not really sure of the color, but I think that's proper and it's appropriate for the summertime, fam. That's nice and light. So chic, I, I would definitely describe chic for those who may be wondering what chic attire is. Basically making a formal fit, unformal. Suit, no tie. It's not too serious, but you gotta be nice. And you have the ability to do things like throw on some sneakers with the suit, like I'm doing here. I went ahead and went with the ponies. It's an interesting selection of sneaker, right? But they're just low cut. They're damn near all white. I liked a little bit of black accent I had at the end on the heel to go with the hat. I thought that was proper. One shirt that I decided to go with, which is a little bit different if you guys were able to, to check the detail, on it is a half buttoned up mandarin collar shirt. 
Okay, so mandarin collars, collars that don't fold over for those who didn't know. All right, and I think that's a real smooth look to also show that I'm not too formal. This is a fit I've really been wanting to bust. I haven't busted it, so this is the first time that anyone's getting a look at it, which is you guys and my family, my extended family here on YouTube. Yeah, let's check the details. I went one of my favorite watches, okay. Black leather band on a Frank Mueller. Young Frank. That's how the photo shoots be. I feel like I should be a model. Somebody sign your boy. Make some checks, fam. I can make anything look good, I promise you. Go back and look at all my other stuff. Like, make anything look good. Give me a shot, fam. Give me a shot. Nah, but look, this is one of the outfits that I couldn't, it was really tough, right? I even put it on Instagram. And I thank you guys so much for those who chimed in and gave me their opinion on what, what suit I should bust. But I got another one here that I gotta put on next, which is actually the one that you guys really chose. It really was the winner. But if it was my choice, I would be busting this one. But I got I gotta roll with the one that you guys chose. So I'm gonna throw that on right now and that'll conclude today's fit. So let me go ahead and get to that. I had a little chain, y'all see I had a little chain gang. Had a little chain gang up in there. A little, uh, uh, all right. Y'all ever hear, hear, <laughs> ever hear people talk? They be like, all right. <laughs> It's like a whole bunch of shit, they ain't said nothing. Yeah, me and my homies just like that. I know y'all got some friends like that, fam. What y'all think of these ponies, though? Would you rock or would you drop? Leave it in the comments below. Did y'all get how tailored this thing is, though? Like, see how they sit around the waist? Fellas, it's important to keep your things tailored, fam. They right, you wanna be proper. And women always say, yo, there's nothing like a man in a suit, right? Yo, but it's nothing like a man who, who wears a suit that doesn't fit him, all right? That shit is trash, fam. You walk around with like trash can jukes, dog. Don't be a poo boy, fam. Get your shit tailored, bro. Oh, sorry, I didn't know you guys were back. I cannot believe you guys wanted to finish with this fit, fam. Like, but you know what, though? I'm not gonna let that, the fact that I didn't choose this outfit, shake my confidence in wearing it, all right? God damn it! How is this for a final chic look? You pull up in this, you making a statement, fam. This blue's a little louder, nice and neat. To be honest, it's really no different. All right, these, these suits are tailored the exact same way. All right, the only difference is the tint and the shade and the blue. But this right here, it will complete the chic looks. Five different looks that I gave you guys wearing the same hat. So I was able to break down from a social to athleisure to street to casual and finally chic right to be honest i would really love to see you guys throw your own spin on it add your own sense of style to these five different categories that i gave you guys today so try picking one hat if you got a law 17 hat that'd be great if not pick one hat in your arsenal one maybe one of your favorites and try to pull out five different fits wearing the same hat right challenge yourself to explore different fits that you haven't tried on in your, in your closet take some risk and have some fun above everything else, right? So right now we're currently at 3,021 subscribers, but unfortunately only 34.6% of you guys are subscribed to the channel. The other 65.2% that are watching this video, what the hell are you guys doing? Subscribe, man. I don't have to tell you this, but it's free 99. I give out free game. Please subscribe to this channel. All you gotta do is click the custom OB logo at the bottom right hand corner of the screen, fam. Do that. Please join the team. We'd love to have you. We appreciate your support. Do that. Thank you. Um, with that said, I want to thank you guys for joining me on today's episode. Be on the lookout. Merch is on the way soon. If you guys haven't already, be sure to subscribe to my new Patreon page where there are incentives if you decide to support me and my channel. And as always, if you guys enjoyed this video, bang that like button, comment which fit you will rock the most, subscribe, and on that note, we out.